Hey everyone, Kyle Wood here with Porter Panasco Living Webcast. I am on an older computer, so I might seem jaggedy. Um, recording's okay. Anyways, what we're here to talk about today is our website. Uh, there's a lot of good information on our website that we think you should know about. Uh, information that we've collected over the last 10 years uh, that's available to the public and to our clients. Um, it's downloadable in PDF file. And I want to cover a few other aspects uh, of our website, uh, which uh, I think uh, you get some real good use out of it. So um, I'm going to stick myself in a bubble, which usually happens. Um, so here I am. We're going to go up to our website, rockypunkkyle.com. And uh, this is a website that we've, uh, we've had for the past uh, uh, nine years, where we started development in um, actually uh, uh, 2008, I believe. And so there's a lot of uh, good information we've collected over the years. So the first thing that I want you to see is the information in newsletters right down in here. Okay, this is the repository of uh, information that we've um, uh, compiled over uh, the years of doing business in uh, Puerto Penasco. Um, the, 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 the three main pieces of information I want you to know about is rules of the game owning property in Mexico. Um, this is produced by the AMPI Chapter 51. AMPI is the real estate organizations for um, our agents and uh, any agent that is part of AMPI also as part of the MLS system to give ma maximum exposure uh, to uh, sellers listings and allows buyers agent to find uh, the right home for you. So um, you're going to want to take a look at this. Um, it uh, lays out uh, what you should be looking for, why you should be using an AMPI agent. The second one is a buyer's guide to owning property in uh, Rocky Point. This was put out by the Arizona Department of Real Estate some years ago. Uh, still useful information, still uh, uh, current, and um, uh, it, it, it essentially talks about uh, what, uh, uh, how you hold title uh, within the interior of Mexico and also in what's called the restricted zone what you should look out for. It goes into some information about the Mexican constitution and uh, um, also uh, uh, warning signs uh, and, and questions that you should be asking your, your uh, licensed agent. And remember all licensed, all agents in, uh, uh, in the state of Sonora um, have to be uh, licensed by the state of Sonora. Um, and then finally, what we, uh, some good information is the sample of closing costs. Uh, this particular one uh, was from 2014. Uh, the, what you need to look at is the uh, line items for your settlement statement. Uh, the numbers may be a little bit different because of inflation. Uh, the, the fees may be a little bit higher, but, but the most important point is to know what you're paying for. And um, we, can, we can request a, a estimated uh, closing costs uh, within our inspection period. And so it's gonna look, what you're gonna get is gonna look essentially pretty similar depending on uh, what closing coordinator that you're gonna wanna use. So. That's a real peaceful use of information. And we're gonna download that in a minute so you can see it. The rest is plats and floor plans that we've collected over the years. If you find a, if you find a uh, condo that you like and you wanna know what it looks like, what the floor plan is like, uh, you can always download one of these uh, floor plans in PDF file. So I'm gonna show you how this works real quickly. You click on something that you wanna download you come down here, you've already entered in all of your information. You would put your name, uh, your phone number, your email address. And uh, remember, we do not sell or give your information to anybody. We will follow up uh, to make sure that you're taken care of uh, and to answer any questions that you have. So you can expect a phone call from us. Additionally, um, we uh, communicate 
uh, primarily via video email now. And it helps connect you with us and it helps you uh, put a name uh, that you see online with our face. So Sandy and I uh, communicate regularly with one-on-one um, uh, -on -one, uh, video emails as well as our video uh, webcasts. So um, we'll see if you're a robot. Hopefully um, robots are getting so smart these days you never know. And then you click OK. And what's going to happen is that it's going to tell you that uh, it sent, uh, sent you an online request. You go to your email uh, folder and uh, uh, you'll see, oh, my taxes are due. Uh, here it is, requested document. Uh, I have to pay taxes, believe it or not, in Mexico. And um, so this is the document that you're going to receive. You click on that. Oh, wrong one. Here, document requested. Here it is. Sample of closing costs. So this is a typical um, settlement statement. And the line items is really what you have to be concerned about, educate yourself on what you're paying for. All of these are uh, normal expenses that the buyers are uh, expected uh, uh, to, to, uh, to pay, unfortunately, but that's just the way it is. And then uh, we also have the seller side here. So notary fees, bank, uh, bank fees, uh, this is a trustee bank, uh, fees for the resorts, if you're in a resort, CFEs, electric company, we prorate that. Property taxes, if there's any due, uh, that is uh, the responsibility of the seller. And our attorney fees and steward title, uh, which is the escrow company. And lastly, the sales commission to the, uh, that, that the seller's uh, liable for. So uh, download that, that gives you some, some uh, uh, good information. As we go back to the, the website, some other pieces of good information that you need to know. Uh, first is uh, seller financing. If you need seller financing, you can click on this link. Uh, we just introduced a new uh, search by price range. So if, there's a, if you know your budget and uh, you want to know what homes are available within your budget, you just click on a price range here between 100 and 200,000. And this will pull up all of the homes and condominiums uh, within that price range. Next, what you're going to want to do is you want to click on uh, the, the name of uh, a particular unit uh, that, that uh, you think that you're interested in. Down here is the MLS number. This is the internal number that all of the agents use to access the private MLS. Uh, we'll give you the square footage, uh, the year it was built, the condo fees, and you have all your nice pictures here. You can email it to a friend. You can request a showing. Um, we do not have mortgages, so um, I don't know how useful that's going to be. But you can request additional information here by putting in your information. Okay. And then it sends me a link showing that you are interested in a particular property. We will either call you or we will do a one on one one-to-one -one video email, and that allows you to respond uh, at your convenience. And uh, if you don't put your phone number in here, we'll try to contact you uh, via our one-to-one -one video email. We find that it helps uh, our, our clients connect our name that you see on uh, the website with face, and Sandy and I. So, um, uh, we, we find that, uh, we find that it's, uh, very useful. So that's essentially it. Um, I just wanted you to be aware of, of what we have, uh, on our, what, what resources we have on our, on our website. One other thing that I wanted to show you, and that is under ownership, uh, frequently asked questions. And, uh, these are questions that commonly come up. Can Americans and Canadians own property in Mexico? Is yes, our agents are required to be licensed in Mexico. In the state of Sonora, they are. 
So this is a good uh, 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 page for uh, those commonly, frequently asked questions. And you can uh, scroll through that. Whoops. Um, and then uh, you can also email me directly if you like, or uh, give me a call. Uh, I have a Mexican cell or a U.S. cell. You, usually the U.S. cell is the best. So anyways, that's, uh, that's it in a nutshell. Uh, that's our website. We uh, appreciate everybody that's come by and taken a look at it. Uh, we uh, are ranking first on Google. We're either first or second uh, in line. We're, all, we're pretty much always on the first page, depending on uh, what you search for. So real proud of that. We put a lot of work into it. Uh, feel free to give me a call. All my information is below. And as always, make it a great day and take it easy. Bye-bye.